day everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to introduce a new series on how to write processes. And our focus today will be on equations. So we will focus on solving linear equations for today. Now let's go to our examples. The first one says solve the following, solve the following equations. Now the first one we have 4x is equals to 3x plus 5. There are two ways of solving this. Is that we collect like terms or we use a balance method. So now let's collect like terms for the first one. We have 4x minus 3x is equals to 5. This will give me x is equals to 5. If we had used the balance method, see what would have happened here. 4x is equals to 3x plus 5. We are going to add, we are going to subtract 5 from both sides. So we have, sorry, we are going to subtract 3x from both sides. So we have 4x minus 3x is equals to 3x minus 3x plus 5. This will give me 4x minus 3x is still x. So 3x minus x is 0. We have 5. Now for question number 2, we have 2a plus 4 is equals to 16 minus 3a. Now let's collect like terms. In this case, we have 2a minus 3 crosses the minus 3a crosses the sign turns to plus plus 3a is equals to 16. The plus 4 crosses the quality sign turns to minus 4. Minus 4. So we have 2 plus 3a is equals to 5a. 16 minus 4 give us 12. So we are going to divide both sides by 5. So 5 goes into itself. So we now have 5 goes into 12. That is 2 times remainder 2 over 5. All right. The last question we have 2 minus 5t is equals to 20 minus 8t. I'm also going to collect like terms in this case. So we have, sorry, 2 minus 20 is equals to minus 8t to give me plus 5t. So we have minus 18 is equals to, because 2 minus 20 is equals to minus 18. So minus t plus 5t will give me minus 3t. So I'm going to divide both sides by the coefficient of the unknown, which is minus 3. So I divide both sides by minus 3. All right. So minus cancels minus. So 18 divided by 3 will give me 6. Minus cancels minus 3 divided by 3. That's 1. So we have t. t is equal to, see, t is equals to 6. The value of t is equal to 6. All right. We've come to the end of our lesson today. I hope you learned a lot. Please kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel for more exciting mathematics videos. Bye.